On the evening of April 27, 2014, a violent tornado tore through the small town of Valonia, Arkansas. It was an EF-4, packing winds over 190 miles per hour. What was supposed to be just another spring? Day turned into a nightmare no one would forget. If you're into true weather stories, disaster analysis, or just want to understand how nature can test the limits of human resilience, stick around. And hey, don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you want more content like this. The tornado touched down southwest of Ferndale in Pulaski County, but it didn't stay there. Over the next hour, it carved a 41-mile path of destruction through central Arkansas, growing in strength and size as it approached Valonia, just before reaching the town. The tornado reached EF-4 intensity, flattening everything in its path. Homes were reduced to debris, vehicles were tossed like toys, and tragically, 16 people lost their lives. This wasn't Valonia's first experience with a tornado. Just three years earlier, in 2011, another EF-2 tornado hit the same area. But this one, this one was stronger, wider, and far more devastating. Entire neighborhoods were wiped off the map. One of the most heartbreaking losses was the destruction of the Valonia Intermediate School, which had been newly rebuilt after the 2011 tornado. Luckily, because it was Sunday evening, the school was empty. Emergency services were overwhelmed, but locals didn't wait. Neighbors pulled each other from the rubble. Volunteers arrived within hours. And in the days that followed, the community came together helping families find shelter, supplies, and hope. Want to see more deep dives into weather events like this? Click that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss a story. Meteorologists at the National Weather Service had issued a tornado. Emergency for Valonia that evening. This is the highest level of tornado warning, used only when a large and violent tornado is confirmed and poses a severe threat to life. Thanks to improved forecasting and early warnings, many lives were saved. But the sheer power of the storm showed how vulnerable even prepared communities can be. In the aftermath, FEMA stepped in. Over 400 homes were damaged or destroyed. But despite the destruction, Valonia did what small towns often do best, it rebuilt. The 2014 Valonia tornado is a powerful reminder of nature's fury and the strength of a community in the face of disaster. If this story moved you, give it a thumbs up and let us know in the comments where you were that day, or how tornadoes have impacted your life. And remember, subscribe for more weather stories, survival insights, and the science behind the storms.